art historians, our work is driven by questions and the objects hold the answers, or so we think. Under the x-ray, we discovered earlier attempts to restore this. I realized how I've spent so much time talking about paintings and talking about the building up of the layering in order to achieve these incredible effects, and I really had no idea what that meant for years. I used to be a practitioner, an artist, and actually I realized that I had like a real huge amount of embodied knowledge that I wasn't actually using. Drawing is also a kind of embodied knowledge that requires a great deal of sort of manual dexterity and technical skill. And I think that I should definitely try to take some drawing lessons in the near future as an art historian. All of these processes are just that, they're processes, that they're techniques, things that you can learn and that you can develop and you can get better at the more that you do them, but they're not this kind of secret genius knowledge. I feel like I can really understand and start to grapple with those ideas um, in a much more complete and I think exciting um, and interesting way now.